Freeze damage to your irrigation system can be a major headache. Fortunately, the steps to protect your pressure vacuum breaker in the fall are simple. This video is not intended to replace published installation instructions or the experience of a trained product installer. Please refer to the installation instructions for further information and product warnings. Consult your local codes before beginning any work. Start by closing the main shutoff valve to your system. Place a bucket beneath any indoor drain ports to collect water that will drain. Open all inlet and outlet drain valves and all test cocks on the vacuum breaker and allow the system to drain. Before blowing out your irrigation system with a compressor, close the outlet shutoff on your vacuum breaker to protect the internals. Never blow out through the number one or number two test cock as this could damage the valve. Connect up the compressor and drain each zone. With the valve and system drained, leave all drain valves, test cocks, and ball valves at a 45 degree angle in a half open, half closed position for the winter. This allows any water that's trapped inside to drain and evaporate. The valve should remain in this condition until startup in the spring. Ensure that the main shutoff remains closed to prevent accidental refilling of the system.